Patrick, we're on the fan at Booth here at EMO 2023. And this has to be a highlight, not just of the booth, but the whole show. Please tell me about this automation system. Yeah, good to have you here, first of all. Thank you. Um, we have a whole automation cell uh, regarding the automotive industry, and we're going to show the production of a front end of a climate compressor. So we start with the raw material on the pellet one, um, take it out, go on a turnover station, and go into Operation 10 in a uh, funnel uh, robot drill and put it on a new high-speed DDR table with the turning function. So we turn inside, um, then we take out the, uh, the ready milk part, go to Operation 20, where we make the outside part, and then shift over to an equator, measure the whole thing. Uh, if there's anything we have to compensate, we can easily um, play it back to the machine, and then we buffer it on an HEV. We can go to a robo cut to make, for example, um, a castaway. And then we have also a SPC station to make every 10th part uh, completely measured. Mm -hmm. So just to confirm, we're, we're going we're gonna to turn the part, we're going to see and see, uh, machine the part on, on the Fanuc Robo drill. And obviously the perception is maybe on lights out, you can make a lot of scrap, but that this is this is impossible. Yes, we've got the we've got the equator. If it's good, it continues the cycle. Exactly. Um, and if it's not, it goes back in the machine. Is that correct? Exactly. So we have a 100% control of each part. Mm -hmm. So why is this? This is an automotive component. Why is it so important for this sector? In our opinion, um, especially the automotive industry, they would like to have an ease of use, high reliability, and a high speed process. So this is an all-in-all FANUC automation mm -hmm. cell. Uh, we have no PLC control. We control everything with the PMC of the robot. So we have a very high reliable product from FANUC as our robots and machines are very well known for. We have a high speed product like our robot drill to generate a, uh, a very fast cycle time for each customer. Um, and we're minimizing the downtime by not using third-party components too much. Mm -hmm. that, that has to be the big advantage. In fact, yeah. you're buying Fanuc, you're buying Fanuc and their integrators. It's all from one solution. You're not relying on lots of third-party businesses. Exactly. So customer now has the possibility to go with our well, very well-educated system integrators, or in that case, uh, he can buy a cell directly from mm -hmm. us. I've mentioned this is a highlight. There's a lot of people looking at this cell at this show. You know, it's, it, it, it's very impressive. Yeah, it is. Thank you very much. I mean, you're very well experienced. So um, if you say it's impressive, then we mm -hmm. made something right. And it goes from a, um, a raw billet, or in this case, uh, a cast iron casting. Yep. And there's no intervention until the part is complete. Exactly. So we have a line cycle time from 60 seconds. So every 60 seconds in that case, you will have a ready milled and turned part. So I can imagine this in a, in a customer's factory. But before, before they place an order, can they see it? Can they visualize it? Sure. Um, before we place an order or make an, an offer, uh, we will have a 3D visualization of the whole cell. So everything is individual, customized for a, for a specific part of a customer and his needs. Um, and also it's uh, worth to mention that we have an IPC there where the whole cell is visualized. So you see on one glance, uh, will there be an alarm? Uh, is there anything mm. I have to look after? Also, predictive maintenance is completely on the IPC in that case. Sure. Uh, and the final one for me, how scalable is it? This is a very interesting component, but what happens if I make slightly different components, slightly smaller, slightly larger? Maybe I need to parts wash in, things like this? I think this is one of the biggest strengths from Fanuc. So we have a very wide range in portfolio in case of robots. Uh, we have um, three different models in case of RoboDrill. So we can scale it up or scale it down to your needs. So if you think maybe about a medical part or a high runner like here in the automotive cell, um, I think this is something we should find out in a discussion with the system integrator together with the customer or us. And how do engineers find out more? So, well, we have a very good website. So www.fanuk.eu. Um, that's the one thing. Or I invite you now, we are here the whole week on the Emo Show, Hall 9, booth C54. Uh, we are here till Saturday so you can see this baby live.